After Dragos assembled the pieces of foam and mounted them on the frame, it was time to shape the team's design into the block. many ways to custom design the tank or body of a motorcycle. Some people use clay. Last year, we used wireframing. The decision usually comes down to personal preference and project dependency. This year, Dragos chose to use foam. Yeah, I love working with foam. It's shaping, it's uh, sculpting basically. The best part of it is that you can go through come up with something and realize it's garbage and glue a couple more blocks together and try again. So. Shaping with foam allows Dragos to create a 3D model with low stakes, while giving the team an idea of how the design matches up with the natural lines of the bike. When you start actually putting stuff on there, trimming them down, um, shaping life into the into the radiuses, yeah, seeing seeing the idea of of what's in your mind come out into reality is, is pretty incredible. With one of the largest parts of the build finished, there is still no shortage of tasks to complete. Next on the list is for Alex to scan the 3D model for us to refine the design even further. 